treatment device to treat pain, particularly back pain. Positioning is very, very easy. You simply take your device, um, turn it on in the pain program, which is the near infrared dominant program, and you place it if somebody has back, lower back pain, just place it directly over their lower back like this. And then if they have, uh, if you want to run the Saloma down the length of the spine, Saloma is great in that it's flexible. So you can just follow the curvature of the spine and place it like this. The treatment area from end to end is 15 inches. So it covers a lot of the spine area and curve it right in against the lower spine like that. Of course, as always, you place it underneath the clothing so it's on clean, dry, bare skin. And as a reminder, you can treat a lot of pain positions in, in a sitting position. So instead of taking up a room, you can have somebody in a chair and again, always place it on, on directly on their skin, but you can do a lot of pain positions uh, in a chair. So treating pain with your Saloma panel is very easy. You can place it very readily over almost any joint or any part of the body, and it will stay in place because it's shapeable and moldable and will stay in the position that you place it. Um, that, that means it's a hands-free modality, which is also very convenient and efficient. So here we're going to use the Saloma Light. We like to use the smaller Saloma panels, preferably, although you can use any size panel over any joint, the smaller panels will fit a little more snugly. And of course, we, we understand that the closer your light device is placed to the area of treatment, the better and faster the results. So in this case, we've taken the Saloma Light. This is a three mode panel, and I have it turned on in the pain program. And we're going, going to demonstrate it placed over the shoulder complex. Now, the ideal way, and a great little tip for placing it over the shoulder complex, is to make it into a, almost like a taco shape. And this really positions it very nicely and very easily over the shoulder area. So if you're using any of your Saloma panels, I'm using the Saloma Light right now to treat any pain conditions. The protocols and the process are pretty much the same for every joint. So I like to preform it into a circular or almost a tube shape, and then place it over the elbow. And, and form it and it pretty much stays in place for the duration of the treatment. And you can move it down to treat the wrist. The wrist is a smaller joint so you can wrap it a little tighter around that area to treat the wrist. Um, if you want to treat hands you can actually treat both at the same time. So this um, device is turned on right now in the pain program so you might be treating arthritic hands so you just place it like this and leave it on there for up to 30 minutes. If you wanted to do anti-aging for the hands, you would just uh, switch it to the anti-aging mode and leave it in exactly the same position. So we are frequently asked about the best position for treating feet, which is actually very, very easy. There are several ways to treat the feet, but our favorite position is to place the device on the ground beneath the patient's feet while the patient is in a sitting position. Again, this, this way you don't have to take up a whole treatment room. And as long as the patient doesn't stand on it or place heavy weight on the device, this will not harm your device in any way. So the patient will just gently rest their feet.